What's up guys, this is the Raven I am back to bring you the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the United States. So to round up where we left off, we are we are the architects of the final destruction of the Russian fleet. So let's get to it. We've managed to force them to sally out of their ports uh, in Isk by attacking it from the land. Let's push the navy out and then our entire doom the arse out of them. And there won't be very much they can do about it. Okay. So let's take, let's go all the way up here. I always like putting my admirals last, because when I put them first, they just get sunk and killed, usually. Okay, let's, let's experiment. Instead of one mega line, let's have two lines. Ooh, we have allies! Or reinforcements. But we just need to hope that they don't swing around and try and destroy them first. So there's the heavy first rate, it's in good condition. Yeah, I think generally these go in the right places. Is it maybe they may, these guys may end up doing something like this? I'm pretty more inclined to just. Uh oh. They're heading towards my other navy. Okay, by the time they've rebalanced, this side should be okay to just do this. Let's go this chap in his first, third rate, second rate. I could just force them to withdraw. So you make sure these guys are at full sail. Yeah, these guys are all gonna pull back. Because they're just being they're gonna be ganged up on by the entire Russian fleet before they can even set up. Get rid of the bon on Richard. Get rid of Ocean when she gets in. You also withdraw. Everyone just clear out. It does, does us no good to have a fleet to get absolutely destroyed, trapped in the corner of the map. So let's just get them out. Especially since the heavy hitters or heavy fleets is in position already. It's not really a problem. But let's get ready to knock out the Okay, why aren't they routing? Is it because he's coming in? Can they only come in? Can they only leave? At the, oh, they can only leave probably at the speed of which stuff can come in, I guess. Okay, 
No, I have no control over any of these ships. Well, you know what? You can't retreat. Some of you are going to have to uh, prepare to defend yourselves. Well, this is really dumb because they're not. <laughs> I can't even control some of these. This is going to be an absolute cluster. All because my raiding, my retreating forces aren't actually leaving. So these guys are about to immediately all be captured. Control some of these ships, they're just going to sail straight on into the Russian fleet. Not ideal. But at least this fleet, well, these fleets are still. they're still screwed. Because the re reinforcement mechanism is fouled up. So this guy. Oh, I can control him now. that battle line. You know, there's lots of blockages. Like these, this guy can't even escape. That's my admiral ship right there that's stuck. Fun on double speed because this is going to be this is the side action really. So this guy's just going to keep putting shot after shot after shot after shot into as many Russian ships as she can. Okay, your guns are working, so I'm going to pivot you to drop a nice, lovely broadside in the in the bat in the uh, parts of this. No, put your ship, put your, put your uh, sails back now. Rear master's gone. I just love the brig is routing. He's to be very upset when he sails into the guns of Bon on Richard. I didn't think you'd like the bomb on Richard. <laughs> but now they're definitely well and truly pinned in against the side of the map. Nope. Sloop sank. Okay, so let's get back over to these fleets to make sure they're still sailing in appropriate positions. 
you within chain shot range? Sort of. Maybe. I think I'll fire off a shot. Just to see if I can put any holes in here. At max range, so I don't hold up much hope. But... Pop. Nope. Okay, so this fleet comes down more like this. Three knocked out. The second one is still in reasonable shape. Let's see if they can reload in time to get a good broadside off on the second rate. Although I doubt it because I've just put down the throttle. Frustrating these withdrawing ships aren't actually doing anything, if anything, of cost me a bit of some useful ships. So everyone's doing drive bys on this heavy first. do about it. to our main fleet. And they probably have to thread themselves through like this gap. So second rate, first rate, yeah and the heavy first is just going to be picked at by jackals. There's a friendly numbers nearby. Oh, is that a Russian ship or my ship? I want to say Russian. If it was one of mine, we'd have a reinforcing ship coming, probably coming in, or we'd have at least a gap. Maybe you guys might come down like so. Let's try to target you against them specifically. First right ship of the line. Forward. Trouble is, this whole melee is happening kind of not in a good position as far as the weather gauge is concerned, so let's do round shot. 
like a chain shot, rather. Good, knocked out a mast. Let's do a chain shot as well. Steady. Rodney's on fire, so let's turn off fire at will. Spin him around. Ship is routing. Good, here comes the mighty fleet. Taking their first shots. Got guns there, guns ready on the left. We've got one. And more would be handy. Fire into Smith Gayan. Let's pull a handbrake turn. Let's put some shots into the masts of this first rate. This is the first rate, sorry. Come on, lads. Pivot around. Boom, 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 boom. Mask down. Perfect. These ships all focus on Sinistria. She focuses on them, she focuses on them, while the ships get into place. Damn right, you're wavering, you're just a lonely, heavy first rate with no support. Break down your eyes. Still on fire, so let's turn fireball off just to make sure you don't die. Get you down to round shot. Pivot a little bit. Boom! Still on fire. Good! Go Bama! Roll time! I'm a big fan of Crimson Tide. Love that film. They're not going to be. Well, the Heavy First might sail into gun range of my other fleet. And Herald's going to open up, probably. And there she is. Ripple Fire. She looks like she's lost almost all the guns on this side. So the only one remaining is this little scout. Sorry, Ocean. It's got to be done. Pow!
now you're really screwed, Russia. This is what you get. You thought you could defeat my first, my other fleet, and you didn't. Hold on. Broadside. Fire! <laughs> Reload. Eventually you'll shoot your way through to hitting. Or just use that. She's dismastered in the center. Yeah, Rodney surrendered, which is not surprising. Fire. I think because we've got this unit trapped, this navy trapped, if they route, it's not like a they don't just go away. They can't go anywhere. If they don't win at the sea, they don't escape. Come on, lads. Although it looks like it's not going to matter, because they've lost most of their mass anyway. Fire! <laughs> Separate one of these chaps from the main fleet. Get the fine round shot, see if we can just eat some shots through and hit Petroslav. Petroslav. Okay, quick pivot off. Fire another broadside left. Just two guns. What happened to the rest of them? Don't worry. We're eventually cutting our way through. Okay, let's triple speed. Because this is the... The only little swine that hasn't routed yet is up here. In this guy's probably going to need to get to here before I can get some shots off. Everyone is surrendered. Okay guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut away and I'll bring you guys back once we finally manage to make this final Russian ship uh, route. So see you in a second. There we go lads. Got a wavering. Eerie's in position and she's just pummeling lots and lots of shots into the back of the second rate. She's wavering. Bon on Richard is chipping away with broadsides through ocean to try and help her morale uh, get worse. Come on, come on, Sinistrea. How can you still be just shaken right now? They're firing at will, they're picking away at a crew. Blast them with canister shot. <laughs> Didn't do a thing. Probably she's quite a big ship. See, I honestly thought she was going to route. <laughs> she was much closer to routing than she apparently was. Okay, just just hunker down there and keep pouring. Keep pouring gunfire into us then, because that's what she seems to want. <laughs> See you in a sec again, guys. Yeesh. And finally, I had to almost crash one of my own ships into a similar sort of position as the Russian one just to get them to finally quit. But still, I'll take it. It's a destruction of the Russian fleet without a single ship of our own. Ship shape and 
And there is one more fleet to the Ships east. Orders. Let's replenish my main fleet. And Get this ready. fleet, it was a bit mauled. Actually, you better get out of the way. Because, ooh, that's where they're all hiding, in central Finland. Let's get these guys... No, they can't replenish because they're this is being repaired. Oh, and there's a small Russian fleet in there. Huh. Okie dokie, let's hop over to other places. Astrakhan still exists. I think I've already looked. No, I can't move you out. Okay, I'm going to hit end turn. Let's see what happens. Reinforcements are moving up. Oh, the Marathas are moving up. Oh, God. They just run around me. Hmm, yeesh. Let's fight this defensive battle at Zehadan. Push the Marathas back a turn. I think I might have to form a new uh, form a defensive position around Baghdad. <laughs> Forts, maybe. Could be good idea. Hmm. But I don't want the other armies. Okay, Mughals. You've called down the thunder, well now you got it. Okay, that's way too many units. So let's pick these three to butt up against the town. Then this flank, let's build up another redoubt. It probably goes through the town a little bit. Okay, let's take you two, go up into the town. Let's put, let's put some riflemen scouts inside the town to you know, have, have these wooden defences to stop cavalry from being able to exploit the centre. So you guys are deployed. Does leave my cannons very exposed on both flanks. Well, looks like my howitzers are going to have a lot of riding on them. Center. Ooh, a bit more line infantry. Okay. You go for the camels. The camel gunners and the lancers are all up on that flank, so let's rebalance my regiment of horse to come up here and support the lancers. Let's get these guys to place stakes. It's a massive foot how it's a unit. Just begin blowing the absolute hell out of their infantry. To be honest, I'd probably rather have you guys place stakes. Bring my cavalry inside the town because I'd rather like them to send a charge of camel gunners into these riflemen after they've placed their stakes, obviously. The artillery, the enemy artillery with shrapnel shot.
efficient way of killing. Oh, wow, there's some there's quick claim shots, I suspect. Go to the artillery on this flank, start to pick at the mortars. It's a more efficient way of killing their gunners than round shot, I suspect. hit Four men should help. Should retarget them. Although it looks like now they are reloading. Yeah, here comes some lovely quick climb shots. Mortars, perfect. Set to work on the other artillery unit, they're just out of range. But they are foot artillery units. So, oh, they might be just out of range of one of the guns. This guy engage them, this guy engage the infantry to their front. Probably give you a bit of support from some quick climbing. How it says. Moving up. Okay, you going to abandon the gun? It's trying to kill there. Need to abandon trying to kill their uh, artillery because you are significantly underwhelmed. So let's also get this artillery unit to help. No, they can't help too much. Or fire into the Bargier barge infantry. Good. charging against their cavalry just to provide their camel gunners some other targets. Uh oh. Let's see how good their elephants do against spikes. I don't know. Not very well. Fire like your lives depend on it, Pennsylvania rifles. Because they do. Delicious, I didn't know they did that well. Aim at the units at the back. Good. 
charge in against the camel gunners because I don't can't really afford to let them run around here unopposed. I don't want to send my general in. As you can see, key artillery advantage is critical when fighting against the Marathas. Pivot. Can these guys get hit by everyone? Turn around and immediately begin attacking. Immediately begin supporting your comrades. Yeah, they did run into my howitzer crew, but they picked my massive howitzer crew. You always reload and hit the sixth Darkini. We not. Oh, they're just out. Okay, advance up. Good. Gunners man your guns. Let's get my cavalry out on the field. So my cuirassiers out. Infantry back into position. Hell, let's go in general out. Things are going so well. And then my cavalry is stuck on up here, so I can't actually move them anymore. It's not handy at all. Let's get my general out. Who's left? It's just the uh, elephants at the range, so let's just. Yep, yeah, because of a stupid cavalry bug, I can no longer use my cavalry. So if I send them to attack, they'll just kill my own men. They're probably going to route, so I'm going to send him over here, ready to kill that infantry unit. And then let's speed it up time. Absolutely continue. Let's hold fire all artillery. Good. May as well wipe out a few of the last units, considering these guys are artillery. Probably won't get. Oh, would have got liked to have been. Would have liked to have got the mortars. Never say never. Oh, good. They stopped and they realised that. No wait, they're pushing their mortar with them. The fools. The equipment will be their death. Jump. It's just a guy. Good. Finally cut him down. Good. So then... Good win. Nice exchange ratio. Knocked him back. 
Oh, finally, the Marathas sleepers <laughs> that have been in Morocco for how many years now? They finally kicked into action. We might have a very, very fun Russian attack to play. If they cross over, I'm definitely going to cause them to, uh, to engage. Russian spies are on the move. Oh, what? Snuck behind the lines and lay siege to Kiev? That's just dumb. There is a degree of unrest in this region, as the majority of the population follow Can a you now leave? to that of their rulers. Send you can if I do that. To proselytize the true religion to the masses. Cut them down. And honor. Humble Good, and you've not really got the firepower to do much else, so let's send you up on the long walk. Yes. You'd have messed up, son. Proud and victorious. <laughs> got on Meyer's effort. Sir. You probably start heading this way too. Can you Sir. raid the ashram? Sir. <laughs> and pull back. Build a fort. Sir. You take them out. Virtue and valor unconquered. Wait a minute. Seminary is not what we want. Sir. Prepare this army to start going to head towards Kumi. You head towards Archangelsk. You hit this boring unit. Choppy chop chop. You replenish and march on Petrovskaya. You replenish and head this way. Make sure people are people are replenishing, because what I might want to do is the old either switcheroo or the old merge aroo. Let's merge up a bunch of troops. Okay, so let's take two, three. You go in there, and let's use you guys to replenish. Good stuff. Probably don't need so many cannons, at least not the big ones. Let's pull them out. And let's put some of these 24-pounders in there as well. Then let's put you as a reinforcing army. It's going to just put you as... Fort. Kiev's not besieged. Let's immediately go back to here and begin grading this to an artillery fort. Archibald thingamajig. Let's build the fort. Let's bring Colin Eden in. It's a useful reinforcing army. So you can mop up the remnants of those Marathas. Yeah, nice and easy little dis little Immediately. stack frag frag uh, stack fragment to knock down. We'll look down. We get reinforcements in. We'll get walls in two turns. Yes, sir. Okay, so let's put you guys in ships. You guys get to Bandar Abbas. Waiting for their orders. Deposit your army, Tobin Davis. Bring them up. Let's bring this navy back to Basra. Let's get this army inborn. 
Get them embarked. Let's put them... It's tempted to do a bit of a raid of them, but I want to have overwhelming force on the border with the Marathas first before I start doing anything too sneaky. To be honest, Stuart Busby, I might have to send you down this way anyway. The armies that aren't needed in Russia, like you, yep, you're doing a long walk too. Good stuff. So let's do some building. Spain. Steam powered mills. Still not being able to defeat those city Prussian, city Prussian ministers. Oh, building here on territory. Can you guys leave? Yes, you can. Let's add some more overwhelming force against because they're so far away. If I'm gonna if I'm gonna knock out the uh, knock out the plains nations, I just want to. Get it over and done with. Uh, okay, okay. Good. Lots of good stuff going on. So. These armies are still on the move. Ready for so. uh, you, are, you are punishing, but I'm going to let you Make do ready. what you want to do. With you actually they're all on the move okie dokie but looking at the timer i believe that's going to be the end of this part so thanks for watching guys hope you've enjoyed and i'll see you next time for the continuing adventures of the united states all right cheers guys